Is it on? Yeah. Welcome back. Good evening. It is Sunday, February 14th. It's Valentine's Day and we are spending our day putting together furniture. Is it really spending our day though? It's nighttime. Okay. We're spending our night putting together furniture. Yay! So I know it's been a while since we've posted an update. It's because there hasn't really been anything to update. No. Until now. Um, so, so it's been how long since the last video? A um, couple months. No, it's been more than that. I'm going to say like five months. It's been a while, you know. Yeah. So we officially got matched with a kid in late October. Yes. A kid that we've been looking at and trying to connect with counties on. Mm -hmm. um, so that finally went through. We got matched in October. And what matching is, is we present a child, our caseworker presents a child to their county. Yeah, right? to the kid's county. And then they look through all of our paperwork, all of our applications, our safety stuff, everything that we filled out. Mm -hmm. And then they compare it to their, what's called a child checklist mm -hmm. to see all of the things that they need. Mm -hmm all the things that we said that we would take and then how good of a fit it is mm -hmm. and then his worker and our worker basically advocate for each other to figure out is this a good match mm -hmm. matching so that happened in october a couple days after the matching she said that we were match basically because yeah. We weren't there. It was something that the caseworkers do. Yeah. So we just waited. It was a meeting that they had with each other. We yeah. weren't a part of it. So in October, we were matched. And then for two months, nothing. We didn't hear anything for two months. <laughs> While we tell you this, we're going to be building, I think, the last piece of furniture for this room mm -hmm. for the time being. Mm -hmm. um, we only wanted to have the basic hardware, the basic things in here. And then once we have a kiddo in here, figuring out what else to add. Yeah. We didn't like want to put... More personalized things that he likes yeah. and stuff. We wanted to keep it very simple and we'll kind of show what that looks like. It was shortly after the new year, um, we got a message from our worker. I think it was middle middle of January. Yeah. We got a message. We got a message that they wanted to schedule a, they call it like a presentation. Um, so we scheduled that and we had that the end of January. Yes. It was the last Thursday of January. So that presentation was pretty much like a full disclosure of all of the kid's records mm -hmm. since he's been in foster care. Um, so they went over everything from like day one until present. Yeah, so all the information, we have a giant stack of paperwork. Yeah. Um, every appointment, every meeting, um, a lot of information about how foster parents take care of him. Mm -hmm. um, he's been with the same foster parents. About two years. About two mm -hmm. years, maybe a little bit longer. Um, 
so they have a good rapport with him there's a lot of stuff in there about how they do discipline how they do rewards how mm -hmm. they do just day-to-day -day routines mm -hmm. um and a lot of that stuff um we're hoping to be able to meet with the foster parents that way we can learn more about like their rules and like their routines and stuff so we can implement them into like our lives once he moves in and it's just kind of something some stability that he would already have yeah. coming into a new place mm -hmm. it's similar but different because we also aren't the same foster parents yeah i mean either way it's going to be a big change but if we can keep things familiar and mm -hmm. similar to what he's been through then yeah and we also learned more about um like his siblings and a little bit more about them and what he likes and what he doesn't like and mm -hmm. it was interesting it was really cool to learn more about him. yeah Almost done with the table. Got it structured. Now we just have to put the drawer together. Is that the last part? Yeah, yeah. it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we had the meeting. We went over everything. That was a couple weeks ago. And then they wanted us to go over everything once we got home. Uh, they wanted us to take the weekend, read through everything. I'm telling you, this stack of papers was probably a good six inches. So we read through everything. Um, it was pretty much to make sure that this was what we really wanted to do um, if we wanted to continue. Mm -hmm. um, and of course the answer is yes. Yeah, in the meeting, the main caseworker broke everything down. Like yeah. these are the behaviors, like basically did a, <clears throat> a summary of everything. Mm -hmm. So we kind of already knew most of it, but they didn't want us to just say, okay, let's go until we made our way through the paperwork and, yeah. and did that. So then we let them know that following mon that Monday, we mm -hmm. said, okay, let's go. Um, and then we found out a week later that that worker was out on sick. Yeah. So now we're waiting to see, cause now it's in the hands of the supervisor. Yeah. And what makes it really difficult <clears throat> besides COVID is that his original county is one county. He's staying with his foster family in another county mm -hmm. Our worker is in a different county, mm -hmm. and then we're in our county. Yeah, so there's four counties, and it's all a lot of fun. Yeah. Um, so they're trying to figure out the best way to move forward, essentially. Yes. Um, so that's kind of taking a while, and I think that's been a big part of the, the waiting, is trying to figure out what the best way to go about it. It's because we're kind of all over the map right now. Mm -hmm. Um, and there's different rules that they have to follow. There has to be a contract. So we're continuing to move forward with this kiddo. We'll call him C. Yeah, I've learned a lot of patience. Um, it's yeah. out of my hands. I can't control anything. So, I mean, we're just going with the flow right now. Because right now, we can't do anything. No. So. But we can do the furniture. <laughs> yeah, we know that things are going to continue to move forward. We just it's don't just know a it. matter of time. Yeah. What, <laughs> what speed? Yeah. So. Um. So hopefully soon we'll get to know when we get to like meet him or Zoom with him or talk to the foster, to the foster parents. Hopefully that'll happen relatively soon.
We did a darn good job. It works. Yay! I'm gonna open the door. We're gonna let the cat in. We have built the what last... we think is the last piece of buildable furniture in the room. Yeah. And it's looking really good. And I'm, I'm really proud because we've built a lot of crap the last like six months. <laughs> built. Um. <laughs> Assembled. <laughs> Assembled. Assembled. Well, we'll do videos closer till and then we'll kind of show what it looks like. Hopefully now we will be able to have more videos because hopefully we will have more things to tell you. Bless you! We're moving forward in the adoption process. Yes. Which is very good because it's been a long a year and a half. Has it been a year and a half? I yeah, since say, we when, started. When did we start? Since we technically started. Um, By the time we get our child, we're going to need to renew our license. <laughs> Probably, yeah, actually. But that's alright, we have a lot of training. Yeah. Um. So yeah, we're waiting. We usually wait to see if anything, if anything's going to come through, it usually comes through on Monday. So that's when we find things out. Which um, is tomorrow for us. By the time you see this, it will have already happened. So yeah. we may have another update. Who we'll knows? See. We'll see. I, hopefully it'll be more frequent updates mm -hmm. because things are finally, <laughs> things are finally moving. Yes. But we don't know how long this contract's going to take. We don't know mm -hmm. next step. We don't know how the three counties need to work with each other. Yeah. There's a lot of things that we don't know, which has been hard because I like to know what's going on, but I'm getting used to it, so. All in all, we have been matched with a kid. We're moving forward. Um, hopefully soon we will get to meet him. Yes. Um, and with that being said, there is probably a lot that we will not be able to share, um, but we will share what we can. Yes. Um, like as far as him we cannot show him um or his name so we'll call him c like i said before or kiddo for the whatever. time being for the time being yeah um but i mean in a nutshell it's been a lot of progress but it's been a lot of progress in a span of a lot of months <laughs> so we're moving forward we're getting there yeah and we really appreciate you guys watching and following us on this journey and we hope that you have already subscribed if not Subscribe so you can continue to see what happens next. Hopefully there'll be you know more stuff coming soon. Who knows? But we really appreciate it. Yes. Um, it's really helpful, and hopefully other people who are going through this process will find our information helpful as well. So feel free to share it, or ask, or ask if you have any questions. Ask us, mm -hmm. um, comment, or message us, or whatever. Or um, um, you know, let us know yeah. if you've been through this process. Mm -hmm. Just kind of helps. Yeah. So thank you for watching. Bye. Bye.